G'day legends, welcome back to another episode. As you can see, we are in absolute paradise at the moment. Crystal clear water, islands, and brought old mate along too. Two grommets, the boat, and the big blue. What more do you want? This one's gonna be epic, let's go, woo! Where are we, Bobby? The island! What do you reckon, babe? Love that. That's home. Little island destination. Bloody marvellous. Check the water out, bud. Oh. What do you reckon, Bobby? Okay. Give us a thumbs up. You unpack and I'll go fishing. Good deal. Alright. Old mate wants a bloody coffee, so we've come in, we're going to throw all the gear out and we're going to head straight back out the front. It's still blowing like 15 knots at the moment, so quick pit stop while it's high tide. Righto, let's anchor the boat. Land ho! Hi Dan! We've got to tie the rope on first. <laughs> well, camp is set up. This is us. Simple, but easy. Sand mat, swag. Bit of food. What are you having? Coffee. Old mate needs coffee. Kids are on the sand. Sand castles. Sand castles. I'm a ball. Sand balls. Sandy balls. That's what I got. <laughs> oh, how bloody good is this place? So you probably can hear there is a little bit of wind out there. We're tucked in a little bay. A few white caps out the front. We're just coming up onto high tide. We're hoping, hoping, fingers crossed, with the change of the tide, the wind is going to drop out and give us a bit of a chance to get out there. Otherwise, we're going to tuck around the tip of this island, have a couple of shallow drops, see if we can't find a few, a few little trouties. There's a couple of fresh little bommies on the way in here too. You do have to remember, this place looks absolutely beautiful, pristine. We're at 20k offshore. But there are crocodiles here. We've, we've seen crocodiles on this same island. There are crocs here. So just be croc wise in croc country. I'm gonna go and have some cocoa pops. Do you want some cocoa pops? Oh, how bloody good. What Hi. Do you, what do you reckon, Bob? How good's the island? Good. Run, 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 run. <laughs> What's our plans for today? Bit of a beach comb, have a bit of a look around the island. What do you want to do, Bubby? Swim. He wants to swim, so go for a snorkel on the reef. Yeah! We're definitely better fishermen than we are spear fishermen. Water was a little bit murky, viz wasn't that great. Kids had a bit of a swim around, so it was good. Tied them out a bit, but we've just poked our nose out off the island a little bit. Still got that, that easterly blowing through at about 15 knots. So we're gonna have a quick drop. Found a little uh, found a little rock with a couple, couple hanging on it. So we might have a drop, see how we go. First drop, give you a quick look. Snap baits. 155 gram and a stripy husser tail. Perfect little trout bait. So hopefully this little trout lollipop can do its damage. Oh yes. Oh yes. Oh, oh wow. What is it? I'm calling it trout. Oh, yeah? I'm calling it. Oh, it's fighting all the way to the top like a bloody red. 
What is that? What is that? What is it? Big Chinaman. Big Holy! Chinaman. Yeah, good. On the snap baits too. First drop. <laughs> it's been a little bit slow, the fishing. After that Chinaman, we've moved about six or eight times. Fishing marks that um, I found last time we were here. Marks that produce good trout, nannies, reds. Just uh, no luck. There's not really too much happening on the sounder. As you can probably see out behind me, in front of us, it is blowing. It's blowing probably 15 knots plus still at the moment. White caps everywhere. So we're hugging pretty tight to the island over behind Courtney. Here. So the island's out there, holding in behind it, just trying to get a little bit of protection from the wind, hoping that it's gonna drop out eventually. Um, it definitely hasn't done what they predicted, but that's fishing. Fair bit of current there at the moment, so what we might do is, if we can't catch a fish on this spot, we might boost back into the, back in around the island, go for a bit of a scout around it, get on the source, and kick back on the beach for the afternoon, I reckon. Sounds pretty good to me. Found a little lump, had a drop. There he is, first little trouty on the snap baits. Courtney's on. Oh, Courtney's on. Yes. One beautiful little trouty. Two beautiful little trouties. How good! Finally, bloody finally. Go back to camp, kids want to build some sandcastles and me and Court might have a cheeky coconut rum, I reckon. I want one too. You want a coconut rum? Yeah. You can have a coconut rum with no rum. Okay. <laughs> Just a coconut. <laughs> Righto. Let's go. Who's in our camp? Pirates. Pirates? There's pirates in our camp. There's pirates in our camp. You reckon they've got rum? <laughs> what do you reckon, babe? Pretty good. Island living. The island life. It's not bad. Be alright if someone supplied all the fuel, the bait, the tackle, the boat, everything else, and then we'd live here. <laughs> Doesn't get any better, but it is pretty bloody beautiful. The kids are up there playing in the sand. We're just going to enjoy a couple frothies. Watch that sun go down. Cook up a couple of those trout for dinner, and then we're gonna do the exact same thing tomorrow. Hopefully tomorrow the wind goes away, but, because the wind wasn't real friendly today. Wiley's no weather man. I don't make the weather, I just demand it. I'm gonna have a few more of these fellas. I'll see you when I start filleting up that trout. We're a little bit sun cooked today, been in the sun all day, so we've retired to the one and only shady palm tree <laughs> but I thought I'd give you a quick look at Arizona's take on uh, the pirates the island pirates now you can see our boat just here this thing over here that's the red pirate ship that's the red pearl they're coming to steal all our rum but why is the rum always gone good luck <laughs> you're drinking it first
Jumat nih. Jumat. for dinner? Mm, fish taco wraps. Fish tacos. Got a like fresh trout, mango, quepi. <laughs> <laughs> Goopy. Fresh trout, mango, avo, green shit. Got some skins drying. Trout chippies for dessert. Yeah. <whistles> How good's that, babe? Pretty good. Righto, drop a comment below. What's your favorite type of fish to eat? Mine's coral trout. Mine's tusky. We had red emperor the other night with tusky. Tusky topped it. So yeah. anyone that says that red emperor is the best eating fish in the ocean, hands down, tusky tops it. But for me, coral trout, you can't go past it. Courtney's stuck on tusky. Let us know in the comments, what do you like eating the most? Make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. It goes a long way to helping us get out here and enjoy this. Don't forget. You got match online. See you on the next one. See you at the expo. <laughs> See you on the next one. See you on the next one. <laughs>